Okay, so I probably will adjust this several times, but I want to be super transparent about why I'm choosing to work with Wetzel's and our Wetzel's powered by thirst. A, a common thought, I think, is why, why would you choose to go partner up or be part of this franchise when it's going well with your own pretzel product? A couple things. First off, I believe in, as if you're watching this, you probably know that I believe in brand over everything. I think brand is the most powerful thing of all time. If it's not the most powerful, it's the coolest and the thing that I like the most. Like, like um, brand equity and nostalgia of a brand, I think goes huge. When I look at a brand like Wetzel's, one, it reminds me of my childhood. Southern California, just the presence of the brand is so, has so much width and it's so large in so many locations. And I think, it, I think of Disneyland, I think of happiness, and I think of my childhood. Disneyland, Disney World, going to the mall, eating a fresh baked pretzel. I think it has nostalgia and brand that's a little bit hidden right now because I don't think that Wetzel's is dominating at their marketing and communications with their customers. And so basically I see this opportunity to take this nostalgic, massive brand and inject it with modern marketing and I think it's going to explode. It's like combine al already so much width and awareness and locations, it's just people call it what it is, with actual 2021 marketing strategies. I think it's going to be a recipe for insanity of popularity and just brand awareness. So one, I think I have something that they don't and I think they have, they have something that I don't in that they have a massive width of a brand and I have the tactics and strategy and hustle to inject that with my modern marketing. That's number one. Number two is the malls are essentially dying, right? Like people are moving less into malls, looking for more quick, fast, convenience, uh, mobile, drive-through. Drive-throughs I think are, I'm just a huge fan of drive-throughs, I think it's the future. And seeing a company, a brand like Wetzel's, where they have hundreds and hundreds of stores, and they're all in a model that's a mall. Meanwhile, I'm here in Utah. I do 99% of my business through a drive-through. I'm pushing massive volume through a drive-through. What they don't have is what I have, which is how to run a busy, profitable, well-marketed drive-through. And what I want to do is be the brand, be the entrepreneur, be the franchisee that takes their model and puts it into the, and is the star and is the, is the standard and is for quite frankly the key to taking their model and bring it into a drive through I think it's a massive opportunity. It's something that they know they need to move forward with. And I want to be at the forefront of that and help them do it. I think it's a massive opportunity. So number two, the opportunity of bringing this business into the drive through model is something that I know how to do and I think they don't. And I think I'm going to be the key to, to changing their business and being the next wave and generation of their business. Number three, I can still continue to keep Thirst as it is. Like we're not changing our pretzel product at the OG Thirst stores. All of Thirst innovation, it's marketing, it's weekend features, it's drink of the weeks, it's personnel, it's company, it's brand, it's authenticity. It will continue to stay the same. Like nothing is changing about Thirst. Nothing is changing about Thirst. You have to think about this as Thirst is taking a franchise of its business and combining it with what Wetzel's is doing it's a combination franchise of just an explosion of two happy brands while each of the other brands coexist separately. Wetzel's, all of Wetzel's stores are going to continue to be Wetzel's without Thirst and Thirst will continue to be Thirst without Wetzel's. All of our same pretzel product or same weekend features and so it's an opportunity for me to go step and try this new thing and execute with this new brand for reasons of one and two um, but also using reason number three which is if it doesn't work I still have thirst and thirst is still amazing it's still do continuing to do and innovate what it's gonna do and so number one nostalgia over everything brand over everything I'm gonna inject this business with modern marketing and it's gonna be an explosion number two they're moving into the drive through model and I'm gonna be the one that helps them do it I'm positive positive I'm gonna be the top performing franchisee zero question in my mind Number three, it allows me to continue to still do what I'm doing 
and not have to stop that or, or, or sabotage that in any way to go out and try this new opportunity, to me, it's all upside. It's all upside. And so, uh, three reasons.